Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Um, bear with me on this video. I'm trying out a new camera that my husband just gave me um, for our anniversary. It's an early anniversary gift. So I'm very excited. Um, I'm doing my weekly melts and I'm normally going to be in front of the camera as always but today I kind of just wanted to be behind the monitor so I can see how it's going. Let's get started. This is a weekly melts and empties. And just bear with me, it might start blurry. We'll see how it goes. But I melted. Yep, see, I'm gonna have to autofocus this stuff. Granny Country Candles, um, eucalyptus. This is gonna be a pain. There we go. Eucalyptus. And this is really, really good. It's so strong. Um, it's. A really true eucalyptus scent it doesn't get any better than that this is my favorite eucalyptus that I've ever melted so I have tons of backup of it and I love it moving on I melted happy hippie scents he sent me up and this was really good um, it wasn't strong it was more of a medium scent throw let me see if I remember what it smelled like. It's a very clean scent. Very clean, um, not like laundry clean, but just fresh and clean. I really enjoy this, but it was a medium scent throw and I wish it was stronger, but I really do like it. So I, I probably, probably would repurchase it. Oh, I love this company. I can't wait till my order arrives. From Lasting Scent Candles, I melted watermelon, raw candy. Let me see. No, okay. <laughs> Sorry. Watermelon, raw candy. And this smells absolutely amazing. The raw candy is super sweet. Um, the watermelon smells, oh, is it a fresh watermelon or a candy like? No, it's a mix. I think that raw candy makes it really candy-like, but the watermelon is like a fresh watermelon. So I love this. Love this company. One of my top for sure and can't wait to get some more. From 10 Digit Creations, I melted Poolside Paradise. And this is so yummy. It smells so good. I love it. Definitely recommend it, and I had a very strong sun throw. This is more like a tropical drink, you know? So, I really like it. Oh, this was awesome. I went to the page to order somewhere, but Granny's is closed. Granny's is closed right now, as I think she got like stuck with a bunch of orders, which she's very thankful for, but, so no one else can place any order. Um, from Granny Country Candles, you're done, baby? Okay, thank you. Mommy will leave it right here. For Granny's Country Candle, I melted deep fried candy bar. This is so good. This is so sweet. Um, you actually could smell like the deep fried candy bar and it was so strong. I love it. This was August scent of the month. I tried to order some more. The site is closed, but as soon as the order is, the site is up, I'm gonna get some more. Love it. All right, I've heard so much good stuff about this from um, Beauty Girl, Tara, and I finally got to try it. It's Happy Hippie Scents 1971. This is so good. Um, I know it's a bakery scent, but it's got a really good super creamy zucchini so I loved it loved it love it love it strong scent throw happy hippie scents powder lake I did not like this one um, very I like powdery scents but this was very very powdery just not a favorite one of mine at all I would not repurchase that but it was super like intense it was super strong 
from Lasting Scent Candles. This is Hurricane Punch. Um, I was not a fan of this. It threw extremely strong. I just don't really like these hurricane scents. I don't know if it's cherry that's in it or it's that blue Hawaiian or something. Not my favorite. I, and the funny thing is I think I repurchased it in this next order because I was just in such a hurry to put everything in my cart that I think I got this, but I'll melt it, but I just won't order it again. Coco Mango Splash. I don't know if I ordered this one as well on my new order. It's really good. Um, I wish I got more of the mango than the coconut. Unfortunately, I got more coconut and it just wasn't one of my favorites. But it's something that I would melt again if I did order it, but it's not something that I'm gonna buy again. Okay. Moving on. I finished my Rose Girls Monster Cookie Fluff Puff and this was amazing as I said in the other videos. Loved it, would definitely repurchase this. I finished the Rose Girls Watermelon Swizzle Steaks. Love it, strong. I did order a bag of that on the opening. Can't wait till they start shipping out those orders. Finally was brave enough to melt Rose Girl Sweet Caroline. I was really worried about this because it has a very heavy cherry scent. Surprisingly, I liked it. Not enough to place an order. I will never buy it, but I didn't pour it out and it was super strong. I melted the Scented Princess, Jenna's Frosty Mint Bean. I love the scent, you guys know that. Let me see if I can get this. Jenna's Frosty Mint Bean, this is so good. Love it, love it, love it. Um, we'll always keep repurchasing it, so I still have some of my loaf in it. I melted the Scented Princess Bedtime Bath. And this is just, I think it's the dupe for the Johnson & Johnson um, Lavender Baby Bath Time or whatever. But this is very strong and it's a perfect bedroom scent. Love it. Cucumber and Mint. No surprise there. You guys know that the Scented Princess has my favorite cucumber mint. I still have some more, thank God. But I love this and I will continue to purchase it. It's super strong. From Rose Girls, I melted lemon blueberry cheesecake bars. Lemon blueberry cheesecake bars. Let me get it out so you guys can see. This is really good. The lemon is super strong. I don't like blueberries. So at first I was a little bit worried about this. Look at it. Look at how beautiful. Gorgeous, huh? So at first I was scared about it because I'm not a fan of blueberries, but you could barely, in my opinion, you could barely smell the blueberry. The lemon, it's such a strong lemon scent. That's really all I smell. So I really like this. Um, the cheesecake is really good also. It's not my favorite cheesecake, but it's really good. So this is something that I probably would repurchase. I don't know if I would put the blueberry in there, but I would repurchase it. From Tiffany, I melted cookies and cream. And this is really good. I don't eat, really know what's in here. I mean, I guess it's cookies and cream, duh. Doesn't smell like cookies and cream to me. It smells just creamy and good. Um, it was strong and I loved it. So it's just weird, I don't know how to explain it. From Tiffany's, I melted pina colada. I still have two left, oopsie, sorry. And this was really good, a nice, strong pina colada. I've had issues with Tiffany's pina colada in the past that I couldn't smell it. This one I could, and I mixed it with this. I mixed it with her scoop of melon ball fizz, and I loved it. This was so strong. Love it, love it, love it. Mixed with the Pina Colada was just amazing. It was such a tropical scent, strong, amazing. So, 
from Rose Girls, I melted lemon cotton candy ice cream cake. And I'm so disappointed that I did not place an order for this. This is so good. Let me get it out so you guys can see it. You have this cookie scent in here. Um, no, it's a cake scent. The cake scent is amazing. It's so good. And you get that cotton candy. It's just, and look at how beautiful this chunk is. I love all the beautiful colors. This was super duper strong. I love it. I love it. I love it. And for sure, next reopening, I will buy a bag of this. I don't know if I'm big on buying pies because I like trying a lot, but with pie groups, yes, because you get to try a lot, but you guys know what I mean. From Low Kitchen, I melted Twinkies. Still a favorite. I'm, oopsie. This is so far my favorite Twinkie scent out there. Um, I'm hoping I will also love the one from Rose Girls because I did order their ultimate Twinkie. But we will see. So, so good. Love it. Okay. I melted my loaf of... Jenna's frosty mint bean, which is now cut up as you guys can see <laughs> um, I love it. It's amazing. I've had this for a while and it's still soft and perfect and this just Smells super strong. I think it's like spearmint Eucalyptus and I think um, Frostbite something like that, but it's really good From Beausavant Frey which the owner is a very sweet lady, by the way. Hmm. I melted one of her little kitchen candle um, scents that was given to her by the owner of Little Kitchen Candles. This is Honeydew Cotton Candy, and this is amazing. And you guys can see, I've already chopped up my my loaf as well. This is so strong, you guys. Strong, it's... I still have it in my warmer since, since last night, and it is kicking. All right, guys, so um, continuing. The video got interrupted. I think my SIM card was cool or something. But this is amazing. I love it. It smells super strong. Um, and you can smell the melon, and you can smell the cotton candy. Her cotton candy is amazing. So last but definitely not least is another loaf from Lainey. This is in Sweet Pina Colada Melon. Get closer so y'all can see that. Sweet Pina Colada Melon. And I also cut this one up as well, as you can see. That's a lot of loaf in there, guys. This smells divine. Um, I get a perfect scent of pina colada. I get the melon. I just love it. And um, thank you, Carby, for those two loaves, because those loaves were sent to me. By Kirby, but anyways, I hope you guys like this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Love you. Bye.